Hey y'all, welcome back to Jackie's World. Happy Saturday. So I'm gonna give you a warning before we get, even get into the video. If you hear any background noise, kids playing outside. Not my kids, cause they grown with kids playing outside. All right y'all, so I seen the video this morning and I had something else planned for y'all today. Happy Saturday, I had something else planned, but the stuff I ordered on Amazon did not come through. So I was kind of upset and I said, should I do a video or should not do a video? Because my stuff did not come in. But I got a good video plan for y'all. So anyway, I saw this uh, video come up on my, I guess, what is it, For You page on YouTube page. And this lady called, um, her channel was Welcome to My Curls, right? And she did this video called Christmas Crack. Okay, and it got saltine crackers. And you putting all these ingredients in saltine crackers. I'm going to tell you what's in it, but... I'm going to flip this version, so I guess it ain't going to be called Christmas crack, but I'm going to tell you what she had in it. Okay, so it's salty crackers, right? And you put, you mixing brown sugar and butter on the stove, right, to make it like this caramel glaze or whatever. I don't want to do all that. Y'all know I ain't trying to do all that. I'm working with the phone, okay? So then, once you do that, you take and put the chocolate chips on top of that, okay, and let them melt, and then you take and smooth that out. Then you take and you put nuts on top of that and you stick it in the fridge for a couple hours. Well, I thought about something that my mother used to do. So when we was kids, you know how you, you grew up and you didn't have a lot of money. You know, a lot of us was poor, maybe still there, hello. But um, we're going to speak to this, we're not going to be, okay? So anyway, um, my mother used to make these peanut butter crackers, right? But she would put, put peanut butter in a bowl with syrup, mix the syrup around in there and she'd make the crackers and eat them like that. Now, I want to try them in the, in the oven, heat it, heat it up the mixture, and put the chocolate chips on top of it, smooth it out, and then put the nuts on top of that. And that's going to be the crack, the peanut butter crack. Is that what it's going to be? All right, y'all. So, <laughs> now look, I went out to grocery shop today, and I was like, man, I spent more money in a Dollar Tree on these crackers. I'm going to show y'all in a second. But I want to give a shout out to my niece, y'all, my niece. So, my niece got a channel called Great Minds, okay? It's, it is GR8 Minds. Go check it out, y'all. It's a lot of material in there to open up your mind, okay? Get you thinking, get you thinking. You know, because sometimes you live and you think everything is small and the world is small, but it's so much bigger than really what you think it is. All right, so look. Um, Let's get ready to try it. Let's get ready to get into it, okay? Let me show y'all. Let me pull my table over here. I mean, I really had to sit up, y'all. I'm upset. I ain't got what I want. Y'all knew I didn't come on yesterday, y'all. I was told. And I said, you know what? Y'all like the video with the uh, the vanilla uh, dump cake so much. I said, let me just let that sit there. Let me let that sit there. All right, so look. This is what I bought from the Dollar Tree, y'all. I bought these first. Before I went to Liddell, Liddell, whatever you call it. Y'all know what I'm talking about. L-I-D-L. These was $1.25 for two of them. And they used to give you a whole box for $1.25, right? So that means I paid $2.50 for four. And at Liddell, for these four, $1.50, y'all. $1.50. I thought I was doing something. I went to the Dollar Tree first, okay? And I was going to just show y'all my little small Dollar Tree haul, but I feel like it really was nothing. And there's a couple things I got on there that I said I'm just going to let it be a surprise, surprise, okay? Because it's going with the episode that I'm getting ready to do. But the stuff ain't coming. But it's okay. Let's get into this episode. Y'all ready to go with me? Let's go. Let's do Let's do this. Okay. So the lady, she put it on the pan. She had a pan. I feel like something in my oven. Y'all, your girl left a double empty pan up in there. Because I was like, what is that smelling? Heard that thing sizzling? Woo, chat. Anyway, so you get the uh, cheap pan, okay, and you line it with foil, all right? I got these little cheap foil. And I probably really need the, the roll of foil, but we just going to double line it. And this might not be an interesting, interesting video today, but it's okay. Because all your girl was doing today was going to the dog on, um, Grocery store. Yeah, but I made sure I kept myself on the budget today. I kept myself. These things so cheap. They're up already. 
That's why I say double lining. If you got these little cheap foil sheets like me, double line, y'all. They used to sell a good uh, Reynolds wrap time in the Dollar Tree. They don't even sell a good kind of that no more. Y'all know the Dollar Tree could run up on them. Okay, so she said you spray the pan. Let me spray this pan. Real good. Otherwise, you won't be able to get your crappy crack off of it. <laughs> Otherwise, it won't come off. Okay, so look. Let's open these up. There it is. Man, I really thought I was doing something. showing me some things she was she was doing some stuff for auntie you know and i hope her channel blow up too hello we're going we're going up we're going up we're going up together all right and i'm thinking i don't i guess it don't matter whatever side you got on can y'all see it now oh my god oh my god all right let me put this down i don't know why i had that up there oh i had it up because of that pain but it ain't look good in my camera. Look, I be trying to look at myself and watch myself at the same time. Because y'all know it ain't no going back at it to nothing. You just working with the phone. This is one and done. You heard me? This is one and done. Y'all, I was a little agitated. One day I was watching another one of my YouTubers. And he had made a video. Um, I'm trying to think of his... Uh, what you call the handle? That's what you call it. Do you call it a handle, y'all? I want to say his um his right channel. Oh, this broke up. She said try not to break them out because they're not gonna be no good. This guy broke out. So we definitely not gonna fool with that one. This just a this just a cheap quick video, right? And if it don't turn out, then what? You know what you do? You just throw it away. Hello? <laughs> Look, I'm still giving tribute to my mama. She did so much stuff. We might ain't have much money, but as long as we had each other. Am I right about it? All right, y'all. So... That's how it's supposed to be. Okay. And what I was talking about was my mother used to uh, take the syrup. Okay, let me get a little bowl. Should have been ready by now. I'm also going to mix up good in that little baby bowl. And I got some other kind of peanut butter. I got this peanut butter. I should have got some more of this peanut butter. But you ain't even got to, uh, what you come on, you got to do is squirt that sucker out. I might have to use some other kind. Okay, then she would just add the um, syrup to it like that, right? And mix it up. Now, I might need to mix up a lot to make sure. So, what they call this peanut butter sauce. Might not be caramel sauce, but it's peanut butter sauce. Right, y'all? Okay, let's make it up. Let's put some more in there. We gotta have enough to spread out the whole thing. Right, y'all? <laughs> I know this video crazy. Don't worry about it. Might not be good as that, um, I know. As good as that tribute to mama, but we working with what we got here. Okay, y'all see that? See that? All right, you see how they come out like that? Let me come up to the screen. Let me come up to the screen. Remember, I'm working with my phone. Okay, that's just your little peanut butter sauce. 
And mama used to make, I bet you a lot of mamas used to make that. You ain't got, especially if you ain't had that brown sugar in the home. What are the use up on making this mess? All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and try to pour some on there. Might have to make some more. Let me come over. Let me come back over in the center. Okay. Yeah, I'm about to have to make some more. It is too thick, ain't it? Almost make you feel like you're in a candy shop. Don't. I'm gonna make a little bit more only because I don't think that's gonna be enough. And I got some cheap old um, peanut butter in the jar. I just ain't feel like food with it. And I ain't measuring nothing out. You just putting it in there to the consistency that you want it. Right? I don't even know why they call it Christmas crack. She said they called it something else too. This is the first time I ever watch uh, Welcome to My Curls. Well, I just love her gray hair. But y'all, I don't like gray hair on me. Okay, and she smoothed it out. Looking for my little spatula. Little spatula. All right. So that's all you're doing is trying not to move it. Ooh. Ooh, 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 ooh. That ain't easy as I thought it was. Y'all. Okay, this is more tedious then. She made it look so easy. But well, mind you, she had uh, brown sugar and butter mixture. I don't have that. I had this... Uh, Peanut butter mixture. And what I tell y'all, this this trial and error. You know, we be trial and error, you know, here. Y'all, these crackers won't keep still. Maybe it'd be better if I do it like this. What y'all think? like that. Put it on the spatula. No, that ain't it either. <laughs> I don't know. Alright, some of these gonna have a little bit extra peanut butter on it. I can see that. And we gonna have to go with it. We ain't gonna stay with it all day. Why was it keep still? Yo, and I knew I said I was going to stop buying stuff. I said that. And I'm still buying stuff. But this was an excellent video. I'm telling y'all, when y'all see this video I got playing next, you could be like, what the, what the, what the, what? See, that lady, there she is. She's coming back with something else. Right, it's a little messy, y'all. But I'm trying. I done broke my son of a gun. I done broke one. That done already cracked up. That piece done already cracked up. Alright, so we're going to go with it. So she put it in the oven for five minutes. And that's what we're going to do. It might not come out the best. I need to keep this spoon. You know, that peanut butter mixture is good. That peanut butter mixture is some kind of good. And you can always, you know, make more mixture. Oh, it might have been better smoothing it on with the dog on spoon. Alright, I'm going to try to put it on. 
for five minutes. Okay. See if it bubbled up like hers did. All right. Y'all see that? You see that? So we're gonna let that sit on there for five minutes. And then, you know, she said you have chocolate chips. And this is what I was thinking about. This one also came to my mind too. So you know I'm always trying to put a twist on the doggone recipe, right? I'm gonna get my chocolate chips out, okay? While that's on. So I have regular chocolate chips. And remember I had those white chocolate chips. So what I think I'm gonna do is on one side, do regular chocolate chips. And on the other side, do the white chocolate chips. And you got to let that sit up and melt. So once that melts, you smear that on here, right? Bring it all the way down, just like I brought the peanut butter mixture down. And then we're going to put the um, nuts. And so the only thing I have got today from the dollar store was the pecans. Okay, so I have already put them in my little chopper back there. You probably can see. So I'm going to put the pecans on top. All right. So while I'm waiting on that, I'm going to pause you for five minutes. Um, it's it's going to be good. <laughs> All right, y'all. So I just took it out of the oven. It's hot and hot can be. Can you see it real good? Okay, I'm not going to pull it up there. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to get the um chocolate chips. All right, I hope I ain't let it sit in there too long for real. Because the chocolate chips got to melt down on the um crackers. Alright, and then remember I said on the other side I'm doing the white chocolate chip. just for a second just to melt the chocolate chip down in a little bit faster all right even though I turned the oven off you know it's still hot I just turned it off and you know it's on 400 so I'm just gonna let it like melt a little bit and then bring it all the way down and then she was also saying about how once you put the mixture together you know you will have to let it sit out and cool down before you stick it in the refrigerator so you gotta let it sit out for about 15, 20 minutes to cool down, then stick it in the fridge for a couple hours, you know, so it can break up. Kinda like, what you call that y'all, bark? They call that bark, y'all know what I'm talking about? I'm sitting up there, look up in the, in the oven. Chocolate bark or something, if I'm saying that right. I'm not sure, but I think y'all know what I'm saying. I think you know what I'm talking about. All right, it looks like it's melted down some in there. Now, let's test it out. Let's test it out. Because I'll be trying not to make my video too long and one. Well, there it is. Y'all see it smoothing? But then she said you had to hold on to the pan to smooth it down so you wouldn't lift up the crackers. I remember, just remember that. So it's going to be hot. So keep on going straight on down with the chocolate. But you see that one already broken up. All right, so. Hmm. They still trying to move. Alright, I'm gonna flip this um put this 
spatula over. So this can be the white chocolate on this side. That white chocolate didn't melt like I thought it would. The white, the, the uh, regular dark chocolate melted, but the white chocolate didn't try and melt. Oh, snap. Well, they go to FUPA. Try to get burned all the same time. So this side done messed up, y'all. This didn't do what I wanted to do, y'all. Oh, that cracker's still hot. She hot. Yeah. So we're going to have some of our chocolate bark. Christmas crack, whatever you call it. It's not going to be exactly on point. <laughs> that one side with the chocolate, plain regular chocolate, to come out good. Oh, well, that's how it breaks up when she showed it. That's how it's supposed to break up. We gotta keep going. We gotta keep going. I'm way, oh, way too far. Was I over too far, y'all? We gotta keep going on this on this show. All right, so I'm gonna put the uh, let me move it over a little bit. We can already put the nuts on it, but I'm gonna bring this piece up to you. So when you break it, it's supposed to be broken like this, and it's gonna be cold, right? Let me see how hot this is. Look, we ain't gonna burn it hot tub. I was trying to check it out before it even cooled down. I'm trying to check it out before it cooled down. All right, let's shake the arm. Um, Nuts on it. This is over. It's over. Alright. And I'm going to put a little bit on my cracker. My little cracker right now. You already see what I mean. It already broke up. Y'all, that thing already good. It ain't even, um, it ain't even cold. You know all that. <laughs> I like that. I like that. Mmm. Mmm. Y'all. It ain't even fully ready. <clears throat> Little that crap got me choked up. <coughs> With the nut and all got me choked up. But it's good. It tastes good. Well, let me show y'all. See if I can bring it that closer. See that? And all you're gonna do is let it sit in there, get cold, and break it up. So I'm gonna let that cool down a little bit more. Stick it in the fridge. I might stick mine in the fridge about two hours. Come back with a little bit broken up pieces. So we can taste it one more time. We tasted it warm, then we're gonna taste the cold. All right, y'all, here it is. The Cracker Rock. Fraggle Rock? Y'all know Fraggle Rock? <laughs> so this is what you're supposed to do, okay? This is the end. This is the end. I took my scrunchie off. I don't even know why, y'all. Let's put that back on real quick because I ain't gonna be able to see nothing. I ain't gonna be able to do nothing. See nothing. All right. So this is supposed to. You're just supposed to be breaking this up. I don't know if I got it cold enough. I did. It, I let it set in there for an hour. You'll know. And you just break it up into pieces. And she said, this way, you don't have a, a mess and it ain't stuck to your pan, you know? Okay, so just like what I did earlier, and just supposed to be hard and cold, let's come on up with a piece. You don't want up, but you don't want up, but you don't want up. So you just break it up into little pieces. Just your little 
candy, whatever, coated cracker. Chocolate coated cracker. Mmm. This is good though. I gotta say, this is an easy dessert and it's good. Okay. Okay. So try it. Even though it's a crazy video, try it. Y'all, guess what? If y'all go back and you heard that knocking in my video, I thought somebody was knocking the door, but I wasn't for sure when I was making the video, right? My Amazon package came. So maybe tomorrow or next week, I got a special coming up for y'all. Okay? Okay? So even though this video might not have been the best, I got another winner, winner, chicken dinner coming for you. Hello, somebody. Hello, somebody. All right. I thank y'all for watching. I thank you for commenting. I thank you for liking. Keep watching. Keep commenting. Keep subscribing. And I see y'all next time on Jackie's World. Mwah. Mwah.